Hi, I'm Gordon, and I'm going to take you through the basics of how to use a Titan Net session. Here I've got a computer that is running the simulator using the Titan Go surface. And on the same dedicated gigabit computer network, I've got an arena. And what I'd like to do is I'd like to use this as a side of stage surface to help control the main show. So my arena is already set up and I know that it's on a 10 dot IP range. I've got a different show here, so it's not very useful to me. I'm gonna tap the disc button and in this set of disc soft keys, we've got something called Titan Net Sessions. Soon as we've done that, I'm gonna tap soft key A of Sessions View, and this is gonna allow us to see what Titan Net Sessions we have running across our dedicated network. Looking at this screen, I can see that my console is here and its address information and software version is listed. To use Titan Net Sessions, both devices or any devices that you want to use must be using the same software version. They cannot be using different software versions. If you look over here, other network sessions, I can see that there's a picture of an arena and there's one called Front Right, which is running a show file called Academy V13. The master address is in the 10 dot range as well. So it's got a little tick to say that that's not an issue. The software version is the same as on my console, so it's got a little tick to say that that is not an issue. I can select it and I can tap connect. Now in my scenario, what I'd like is the arena to still be controlling the show, but this just to be an extra surface to help out. So I'm gonna select connect as multi-user. What this is gonna do is this is gonna check the network. It's then going to grab every bit of show information from the arena and it's gonna put it on my surface. This surface will still have its own programmer. So I need to make sure that I press clear on this surface or on the arena, hold down the clear button and tap that soft key G of clear all programmers. Now I can select some fixtures and program them and the DMX or ACN or ArtNet information will be coming out of the arena because that is in charge. When I'm done, I can tap disk and I can go back into that Titan Net Sessions menu. Soft key E says leave session and this is gonna disconnect the two but it's gonna make sure the arena is safe. And this is a much better option than just pulling out any Cat5 cables that you have. This simulator surface has now loaded the last show that was alive on it. The arena is still continuing to be in charge of the show. I can then close and leave Titan on this laptop and mean that I'm absolutely fine and I'm safe to continue my show. That's the basics of how to use a Titan Net session using multi-user. Thanks for watching and tune into the next one.